It's time now for your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. Meteorologist TJ Del Santo joins us now. We're in for some decent weather this weekend and a couple fun events happening too. Yeah, it looks uh, to be a decent weekend overall. And among those uh, fun events are the Bowens Wharf Seafood Festival in Newport, both Saturday and Sunday. Hey, these are live pictures right now from uh, Bowens Wharf. I'll have more than two dozen vendors offering seafood as well as barbecue and cooking and conservation demonstrations. Benefits the Oliver Hazard Perry Tall Ship Education Program. You can also visit that ship while you're there at the festival. And WPRI 12 and Fox Providence are proud sponsors of the event. There'll be fish tacos, lobster rolls, fried calamari. Sounds like a fun time down there in Newport this weekend. And for the most part, the weather should cooperate. Live Pinpoint Doppler 12 radar. No rain out there. Right now, it's nice and dry. A threat tracker for today, Saturday and Sunday. Low chance of anything severe. However, we do have the chance for some showers for the weekend. We'll talk about the timing in just a second. Live pictures uh, from Newport. There's Bowen's Wharf. This camera's on Long Wharf. Kind of looking at the uh, uh, Bowen Wharf right now, 59 degrees, wind from the northwest at 9 miles an hour, kind of cool down there. 61 in New Bedford, 64 in Taunton, up in Smithfield, 61. Many areas were down in the 30s and 40s this morning. Satellite radar picture, we've got clear skies for now, but some clouds beginning to gather, and they'll continue to work their way towards southern New England as this area of high pressure kind of drifts away. Wind from the southeast will help to draw in some of the cloudiness, even inland throughout the late afternoon and evening. And notice, here we are, 8 o'clock Saturday morning. Those clouds still around. Maybe a glimmer of sun, but also a few showers in the area. We'll see some occasional showers on a Saturday. Not a washout, but there will be some rain showers in the area, including down there in Newport. So not a bad idea to bring along the umbrella as you walk to Bowen's Wharf. It's under a tent. It's rain or shine, so overall looking okay. Uh, taking you into Saturday night, with some rain showers passing on through into very early Saturday morning. Then just a few lingering showers throughout the rest of the day on Sunday with lots of clouds around. It'll be breezy on Sunday as well. A little warmer with temperatures getting into the 70s. Forecast for today, though, a little more seasonable with uh, sunshine giving way to clouds about 65 degrees for tonight. We are looking at a uh, night not nearly as chilly as just this past night. Overnight low temperatures will be around 53 degrees. Dry through the evening could be a couple of rain showers around very late in the night. Forecast for the Bowens Wharf Seafood Festival, the 27th annual. Few showers around on Saturday, about 70 degrees there in Newport. On Sunday, a spot shower possible. Temperatures should be topping out in the low 70s. I think Sunday will likely be drier than Saturday, but it will be pretty breezy. Here's that live pinpoint Doppler 12 seven day future cast forecast for Saturday. The rest of the area looking at temperatures to get into the low 70s in the afternoon. Couple of showers around from time to time. Again, not a washout for Sunday. Temperatures getting into the mid 70s in the afternoon hours in the Providence area with a brief shower possible. In fact, the day may start off with some clouds and mist and we'll see some sunshine be fairly breezy as well on Sunday everywhere, including Providence and Newport. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. Look at that string of sunshine looking good. Get kind of chilly on uh, Tuesday with high temperatures only in the upper 50s and morning lows maybe in the 30s and 40s once again. But then we go back to more seasonal seasonable temperatures for Wednesday and Thursday sunshine uh, highs in the mid to upper 60s in the afternoon. So we're not looking at any washouts for the upcoming weekend, but a few showers are around and meteorologist Tony Petrarca will have your updated future cast beginning at 5 p.m. Today looks fantastic weekend. Not too bad. All right, awesome. Thank you, TJ. Now in stories coming up new tonight, starting live at 5. Compassionate crime fighters go out of their way to help a family in need after a traffic stop triggers powerful emotions from a struggling mother and her kids. We'll tell you how police helped turn their fortunes around tonight at 5. Then all new at 530, hundreds of mourners gather to say farewell to a Massachusetts police officer who was tragically killed by a wrong way driver. And new at 6, a Providence ministry that provided help for countless people failed to get the help it needs to avoid foreclosure. Those stories plus all the day's breaking news later on Eyewitness News. And if you're not home by 6 o'clock, you can get an update on all the day's big stories every weeknight on Eyewitness News at 6.30 over on